COVID. I thought the pandemic was over. I hear comments like this all the time. Not quite, folks. As of August 9th, a new variant called XFG or Stratus makes up about 65% of all U.S. infections and is now the dominant variant worldwide. See, Stratus is a combination, it's a hybrid rather, of two Omicron strains, LF7 and LP812. That combination makes it spread faster, meaning it's more communicable and evade past some of our existing immunity. The good news is that the Stratus variant doesn't seem to be more severe. Symptoms are very familiar, sore throat, cough, fever, fatigue, muscle aches, sometimes loss of taste or smell, or diarrhea. Now, some people call it a razor blade throat, meaning the severity of their symptoms, their sore throat, but overall experts say the symptoms are pretty much the same. Now, if you test positive, act fast because antivirals like Paxlovid work best early, especially for older adults and people at higher risk. Talk to your doctor. So what about the updated COVID vaccine? Everybody wants to know what is going on. And information is hard to come by this year. But I have read that the new 2025-2026 messenger RNA vaccines target LP812, which is one of the strains that created Stratus, the dominant variant. So this should mean that these boosters should give solid protection. Now, I know there's concern about access to the updated vaccine, where it will be available, when it will be available, and if it'll be covered by insurance. I don't have answers to that. We should uh, get some in the next couple of weeks. Remember though, COVID is here to stay. Sadly, an average of about 350 people have died each week this year from COVID, according to data from the CDC, data as recent as May of this year. Remember folks, we still have tools to combat COVID. Staying up to date on your vaccines, test if you're sick with the rapid home tests. Remember to mask in crowded indoor spaces. Try to improve your ventilation and call your healthcare provider if you test positive and are high risk. Hello, I'm Dr. Rhonda Johnson. It's Monday, Labor Day, September 1st, 2025. Stay safe, folks. Have a great day. And as always, take care and be well.